And if they were more serious, they'd get a warrant, right? But these are no, no. They they can they can rack up uh, citation after citation until we will actually physically walk a case through. As Tina had mentioned, it takes a uh, officer preparing a filing report, uh, so a charging report, and that's after we identify somebody uh, who is a recidivist that is a problem because we see an excess of 120 of these uh, recidivists that actually fit the criteria sent to us each month from the court clerk's office. So we, we obviously have to be judicious in who we pick because it takes a lot of staff time. So we uh, find a recidivist that's actually a real public nuisance problem that's been identified by our staff. They prepare a charging report. Uh, they walk it over to, to John Barrasoni's office. After verifying all the failure to appear data, then John Barrasoni's office, city attorney, verifies all that failure to appear data as well, then walks a warrant through the courts. Once the warrant's signed, he notifies our office then we uh, actually find the person and arrest them. And then they finally go before magistrate. All right, I appreciate that. I'm just, correct me if I'm wrong, but it seems like there's a little dotted line. Like if you get a DUI, you don't, you get a, a warrant if you don't, you get a failure to appear, right? Correct. So Yeah, so, that's, a book, that's a bookable violation. So you're actually right, booked right. So these charge. are So these are non-bookable violations. These are our municipal codes. Right, it looks like a lot of them are related to being homeless, camping in city, prohibited camping, prohibited panhandling, manner time. Or public nuisance, yeah, or public activities, nuisance. open container, yeah. Right. Okay. Um, yeah, it's it's no one's fault, but it sure is a big irony that here we have this huge expense because we're not solving homelessness and we've made it largely unpermitted to be homeless. And so, you know, it just sort of piles on top of each other. I find well, it kind of someone's sad fault. Ironic. <laughs> well, <laughs> but there's no accountability on the back end, but, uh, you know, that's just the first step. I don't mean it. I mean, it's no one's fault in the system that we have yeah. this this problem with the citations and the homelessness and it's not, you know, I know it's not the police's fault that yeah. the system is ironic or sad, but I, I find it kind of sad that we're spending all that money not solving homelessness, but instead, you know, citing people for a problem that we're not solving. Anyways. Agreed.